the people touting for business are more aggressive here. I think I'm part of the problem though, aren't I? <laughs> it's a really beautiful place. I recommend everyone to come here. Welcome to another episode of Tag Along with Chai. We are at the International Airport of Ho Chi Minh City and we had to say goodbye to Ilona. She's leaving back to Thailand. She's not the only one. I'm staying behind, but there are a lot of people leaving here as well, leaving Vietnam. So let's find some interesting people to have some chats with them to see how their experiences were in Vietnam. Did they have a good time? Did something extraordinary happen? Are you leaving Vietnam? I am indeed. Yeah. How long have you been here? Uh, about a week, maybe a bit oh. more, 10 days. Okay. Pretty short time. Yeah. I've been traveling around Southeast Asia uh, a little bit. Where have you been before? Just Singapore, a bit of Malaysia, yeah. Thailand, okay. Cambodia, Laos, and then worked my way down yeah. Vietnam. Awesome. How was your Vietnam trip? It was good, yeah, yeah. really good. A bit fast, a bit quick. Yeah, <laughs> Only one or two nights in every place, yeah. so quite short. Would you do the same thing next time? Probably. I like to work quick. I, I like to yeah. see cities very quick and yeah, then yeah. move on. I don't ah. like to hang around. Did much. you start in Hanoi? And then start in Hanoi, Hanoi Ha Long Bay, Hue, Hoi An. And then Ho Chi Minh. Was this your first time? It was, yeah. What were your first experiences here? Did you like it or were you a bit disappointed? No, I thought it was brilliant. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, you can see that the tourist industry is starting to build. It's not like Thailand just yet, yeah, yeah, yeah. but it will get there. Yeah, I, I okay. think it was, yeah, I think it's good. Very yeah, good. Yeah. Is this something that is really sticking out? The people, very kind. Yeah, very helpful. Want to help, yeah. yeah. Didn't feel like that I was annoying people being a tourist or anything like that and they, everyone was there to help so yeah, yeah. yeah. Did you notice something else compared to the other countries that you've been? It was easier to travel around than Laos and yeah. Cambodia, not as easy as Thailand okay. um, but I'd say the food's not as spicy as Thailand. Yeah that's true. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 That's it. Did you like the food? Yeah, I loved it. I try, I try. I don't just want to try the the foe, is it? The, yeah, the, the fur, I fur, yeah, 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 yeah. I try in different things. Yeah. So, so I tried the pancakes today. I don't oh, know okay. the crispy pancakes. Yeah, yeah, yeah which yeah, are yeah, different. Yeah. Is there something that was maybe not so pleasant on your trip here in Vietnam? I thought Ha Long Bay maybe has been. You, you see the Instagram pictures, yeah. and maybe it doesn't live up to that. Okay. So that's probably a little, not a disappointment. Mm -hmm. I kind of expected it not to be as good as the pictures, yeah. but yeah, a lot of boats as well. I think I'm yeah. part of the problem though, aren't I? Because <laughs> yeah. I'm maybe, one of the boats. Maybe, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love the history, um, history teacher. So I liked going around, learning about the bit more about the war, a bit more yeah. about the the French war as well. I didn't know a lot about that. Do you teach uh, the kids, let's say, on school a also about this? So, yeah. so this year I taught about Hue and the. Um, um, and the citadel and the attack there, a bit about the Tet Offensive, so it's quite interesting. Oh, back in England, is, yeah, are, they, are the ki English kids interested in... They love Asian history, yeah. love Japanese history oh. and they love learning about Vietnam. Okay. So where are you flying to? Home, oh. ba Bangkok, then home, yeah. just changing flights in Bangkok and then it's been a long... Well, four weeks, so yeah. not that long. Not Four intense weeks? Yes, because yeah. I don't stop. Travel more, meet people, the world's a small place. English but living in Thailand 25 years. And uh, how long have you been in Vietnam? Four days. Are you doing, let's say, a visa run kind of thing or? No, business. Is there anything else that drives you to Vietnam or is it just business? This trip was just business, but yeah. a chance to look around. What's so good about Vietnam? Do you, do you like something in particular? There is order here. I'm from Thailand. Um, it's basically chaos and lawless. Okay. Um, here there are rules and the people keep to them. So that's quite nice to see. It's quite difficult getting around here if you're not from here. Okay. You've really got to know grab. Yeah. And I don't. But it's a beautiful city. Yeah, so you've been only visiting in Ho Chi Minh then, I guess? Or yeah. Lose from the order. What else is so good about the city? It's still an individual city. It's not all, you know, the coffee shops, many of them are family businesses and things, whereas yeah. in, in Thailand now, um, I'm, I'm comparing everything to Thailand because yeah, okay. that's where I'm from. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, it's nearly all branded chains. Okay. Whereas here, there's still a bit of individuality. Yeah, yeah. Um, the driving here is respectful. It's chaotic, but it's respectful. <laughs> yeah. In Thailand, it's chaotic and not respectful. Yeah. It's funny you say this because uh, coming from Thailand, we are based in Thailand actually yeah. with the channel. Coming here, I do have to say like for me, it was a little bit of a different experience yeah, coming sure. here and so much chaos and honking. and it's structured chaos the people are more respectful here to each other if you look at the motorbikes yeah. madness that it is it sort of works yeah yeah, yeah, yeah yeah whereas in thailand there's crashes all over the place mm. this is something that is maybe not so pleasant here uh, something that vietnam could change to make uh, better for tourism let's say the people touting for business are more aggressive here yeah 
in Thailand, you say you don't want them. They say, okay, I'm having and, and they move on. Here, they, just, they follow you down yeah. the street, which is a bit irritating. When I come over here the first time and, uh, and people are uh, a bit rude in my experience, but I found out that they're maybe just a little bit louder and a bit more upfront. Yeah, they're not rude, no. um, but they're, they're more aggressive in chasing the business. Yeah. Yeah. To the point where it becomes irritating, yeah. but you understand that they've got to make some money somehow. Yeah. What I did learn was never stop here and look at your phone or look that way because they'll be on you yeah. immediately. Yeah. So just even if you don't know where you're going, just keep walking. Do you like the food here compared to Thailand? Or I didn't really experience much of the Vietnamese food. I've had it in Thailand. I found it a bit tame. Okay. Yeah. Not nice enough, yeah. but um, not as tasty as the Thai yeah. food. Are you coming back soon, sir? For pleasure, let's say. Uh, three months. My wife and daughter want to visit Vietnam. Uh, they, do, yeah. they couldn't come this time. Okay. Um, but we have decided we're going to come in three months. Nice. Yeah. Okay, good for you, sir. If you want to experience the chaos of Asia, but without the stress of Asia, I think this is a good place to come. I'm leaving, but I'm coming back again. Oh. I've been coming back, back and forth many times. Okay. Uh, what are you doing here? Well, uh, pleasure and also uh, work. So I love coming here. I love the food. I love the people. It's an amazing environment as well. Yeah. What yeah. kind of work do you do, may I ask? I do healthcare uh, okay. software. Healthcare software? Yeah, oh. so health tech. Yeah. Basically. Is there a big market here? Yeah, it's a big market. Yeah. It's a big and new market as well. Uh, there's a lot of compliance, but uh, you know, there's a way around that. So you going back for a holiday then? or? I'm going back to Kuala Lumpur. So I live in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. Oh, yeah. nice. Yeah. I like Kuala Lumpur actually. We, we love yeah. that city. I've been living there for 12 years now. Did you only visit Ho Chi Minh this time? Uh, no, I visited many places here. Phu Quoc, Phuong Tau, Nai Trang, Hanoi. You've been all over. Yeah, yeah. Uh, many places. What's your favorite place? It's really difficult to say so. I love Hoi An. It's a really nice, quiet, clean place. Yeah. Anything else that really sticks out in a good way? Food, always. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love the food here. Yeah. I really enjoy it. I, yeah. I just had a big meal before ah. I go to the airport. It's something else because we all know pho, but like there's so much good, like, yeah, amazing there's food. So many. There's yeah. so many. I love the Thai food, but um, you know, uh, Vietnamese food is very special to my heart. You're coming here for such a long time. Is there something that is missing here in Vietnam? I honestly hate the traffic here. But other than that, really no complaints. Uh, no. The people are really friendly yeah. as well. It's an amazing country, isn't it? It is. It yeah. is. It's a beautiful So country. if you have to choose between, this is a naughty question of me, uh, between Malaysia and Vietnam? I wouldn't really choose either. Uh, I would consider Malaysia as my second home, honestly, because I've been living there for so long. I lived in other places as well before, but uh, Vietnam, on the other hand, it's, um, you know, it's, it's a place where sometimes you want just to take a break and come and kind of uh, revive basically or uh, rejuvenation yeah. so uh, nice. it's a really beautiful place yeah. I recommend everyone to come here yeah. at least once how long have you been here and how many times have you been here already five or six weeks okay second time yeah you like it yep do you have to be here or you're here on the like say a holiday kind of thing uh, getting dental work done what's the best thing that happened to you in Vietnam everything just the experience the grab bikes the food the warmth did something happen that was maybe not so pleasant? Other than the dental work, I can imagine that's not the, the most pleasant thing to do. Um, no, they're lovely people. Yeah. Exceptional. I can't believe how friendly they are yeah. to each other and no road rage and no yeah. cranky. Yeah. So um, it's remarkable. Yeah, I went to Vung Tau, I went to Phnom Penh. Yeah. Um, but I didn't travel as mu much as I wanted to because okay. of the. The dental was spread out. You crossed the border in your six week stay yeah, in Vietnam. I had to renew my visa. Was yeah. that easy? Yeah, online, yeah. You just need to know how long it takes. Yeah. And how long did it take to? Uh, four days. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. From when I um, put, did it online and yeah. got the email. Yeah. yeah. But I had, you have to get out. Are yeah. you flying back to Australia, sir? Yeah. When are you coming back to Vietnam? Three months. Oh, actually, yeah, you have Within, to. Yeah, I have to. Oh, for your dental care again? Yeah. Ah. So, yeah, I might come back and um, stay for 12. Yeah. Are uh, you happy with the service here and, and the dental work? The service is every, exceptional everywhere. Yeah. yeah. Um, and done with a smile. Probably the worst would be um, the rubbish. Uh, okay. Whoever gave um, <coughs> Asia access to plastics, yeah. 
should be uh, put on a rocket to Pluto. They just don't know what to do with it. How come in the first place did you come here? Just because of work? Yes. What are you doing? Uh, in the shoe factory. Go back to Taiwan. Oh yeah? For shoe vacation. Uh, for how many days are you going? Uh, seven days. And then coming back to Vietnam again? Yes. Do you live in Ho Chi Minh? Uh, Pinyung. Why do you choose to live here and not in Taiwan? For the career. <laughs> yeah, okay. For the career, yeah. 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 Better, better career, yes, ah, here. Okay. Yeah, because uh, the factory the factory is still in, uh, in, in Vietnam is better. Do you meet a lot of Vietnamese people here? Yeah, or you sure, have... sure, sure. I work with them every day. Yeah. Yeah, I, I like it. I like it. Yeah. They, are, they are very passionate. Are they different than Taiwanese people, you think? Sure, sure, sure. What's the biggest difference? Uh, I think they are more... Uh, smile, smell more. <laughs> huh? Smell, uh, smile, smile, oh, more. smile more. Yeah, yes, yeah, yeah, like a, like a, they are very uh, relaxed. For yeah, yeah. I think, I think they are more happier. They, oh, yeah. uh, less, less pressure. They enjoy their life. Ah, <laughs> so you're happy to live here? Yeah, it's good. It's Do you good. think you're gonna stay here for much yes. longer? Yes, yes, I think. Can I ask you if yes. you're married or are you? Yes, my my family. Yes, I'm married and I have two sons. And are they from here or are they from Taiwan? I'm from Taiwan and. Like they just go back to Taiwan to have a summer vacation. What is the best thing about Vietnam, you think? The food is good and the people The people here is very uh, welcome. Yeah. It's, uh, so travel in Vietnam is also good. Is there something that is maybe not so pleasant living here? I think the transportation is not so good enough. Like uh, the subway system, they make it for, for a long time. I don't know when they'll finish. <laughs> <laughs> is there a, which subway system? Like? <laughs> <laughs> yes, they say they will, they will finish. If, uh, from 2020, but now still ah. still not, not yet. But I can imagine if that metro system is working okay, then it's a really, yeah, really... Yeah, yeah, I think we'll change. Yes. The city will change. Yes. Yes. People are leaving Vietnam here at Ho Chi Minh International Airport. Everyone seems to quite like Vietnam. A lot of people live here or wants to come back here for either way business or pleasure. For the next few episodes, I won't travel a lot. No, I will stay in Ho Chi Minh City, explore the city. There's a lot to see and there's also a lot of people to talk to. Thank you so much for watching till the very end. I would like to say from Ho Chi Minh International Airport, bye for now and stay champ.